The materials needed for this project are pretty much things that you'd find at home. Um, we're going to use newspaper, can be any size. Um, I do recommend that it's the black and white, um, not a heavy, heavy thickness, but something that um, is easily folded and manipulated. We're also going to use masking tape. Um, Definitely not scotch tape because we want to paint this project eventually and masking tape will still hold that pink color. Um, that's basically the shape of the project. Then we're going to paint and when we paint we're going to use an acrylic paint um, for the base coat. Um, I don't recommend tempera paints. They have too much of a gel medium to them and they don't dry as well. The acrylic paint will actually dry and harden and keep the snake's shape. Um, for embellishing, we can use a glitter paint, and this is a tempera, but we're going to coat over the top of the acrylic. So this is no problem um, as far as putting it on once we've done the acrylic. We'll use our paint brushes for painting. I've got um, some water here for changing out colors. And then for embellishing, we're going to use some googly eyes, which are always fun. Googly eyes for the eyes. We're going to use some sequins to make our snake bright and shiny and fun. And we're going to use a pipe cleaner for the tongue. Um, these products can be found in your, in your craft store, in your local art supply store, um, or you may just have them on hand.